Peppa Pig Tales. Let's jump in! Hello, children! Has everyone remembered their T-shirts? Today, Peppa's playgroup are having a special art lesson. They are making tie-dye. What is tie-dye, Madam Gazelle? Tie-dye is a special way of painting T-shirts using lots of different colours, like this. Oh, I thought we were dyeing ties. It's my granddad's. Oh, don't worry, Danny. Any fabric will do. You can make a tie-dye tie. <laughs> now, let's get ready. Peppa and her friends have put on special gloves, goggles and coats before they tie-dye. First, we add a few drops of dye to the water. Dye is like a special paint for clothes. You can mix any colours you like, but you only need a few drops. Ta-da! <laughs> My T-shirt is going to be red. Blue and yellow make green. My tie is going to be pink. Really pink. <laughs> My T-shirt's going to be a rainbow. <laughs> All the colours have combined to make Muddy Puddle Brown, not a rainbow. Oh! Don't worry, Gerald. You can still make your T-shirt rainbow coloured by dipping it in lots of different colours. Can I make my T-shirt rainbow too? Of course. That's what we're all going to do. First, squeeze your shirt together and wrap elastic bands around it, like so. Squeeze and... Oh. <laughs> <laughs> when your elastic bands are ready, it's time to add the dye. A little at a time, just like this. Splash! 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 Everyone is having lots of fun dunking their T-shirts in the different coloured dyes. Now it looks like a rainbow. Pepper has accidentally covered her protective coat in colourful spots. Oh, that's why we wear coats, to protect our clothes. Let's tie-dye more things, like the curtains or the chairs or your handbag. Uh, let's stick with T-shirts and ties for now. It's time to hang them outside to dry, so they're all ready by home time. It is home time, Yay! and the tie-dyes are finally ready. Look, Daddy, it's a rainbow. Oh. Oh, it looks fantastic. Mine has a muddy puddle underneath. It's a pink tie-dye <laughs> tie, Granddad. Everyone loves making tie-dye and everyone loves wearing it too. <laughs> Today, Peppa and her family are at a science museum. They are very excited to see an exhibit all about magnets. <laughs> oh, these aren't magnets. They're fish. The fish are made of metal, Peppa. So we can fish them out with these magnets. <gasps> Fishing rods. Just like on Grandpa Pig's boat. Just be careful. Magnets can be quite sticky. Phew! Peppa and George are catching lots of metal fish. And metal glasses. And metal keys. And all sorts of metal objects. Stop! May I have my watch back, please? Whoops! Sorry! So very much! <laughs> Bye! <laughs> Bye! There we are. <laughs> oh, maybe not. <laughs> Use the magnets to race your magnetic slime to the end of the track. What magnetic slime? Maybe this button will give us the slime. Splat! <gasps> Magnets ready! Oh, yeah! <laughs> Whoa! Steady, go! <laughs> the 
The slime has little bits of metal in it, so it can stick to the magnets. I'm winning! I'm winning! <laughs> and the winner is... Oh! Uh... Um... I can't see who the winner is. <laughs> <laughs> Wee! <laughs> what was that? Oh. <gasps> Look, George. Hmm. But what do pictures of us have to do with magnets? Hmm. Aha. Uh -huh. Whoa. <laughs> ah. The board uses magnets and little bits of metal, so you can draw on the pictures. How creative, George. Dinosaur. <laughs> <laughs> what do you think, Daddy? I look great, Peppa. Ah, not again. <laughs> everyone loves learning about magnets at the Science Museum. Well, everyone except Daddy Pig. <laughs> Daddy Pig has to pick something up from work, so Peppa and George have come with him to his office. Sorry, Mr. Rabbit. Phew. <laughs> George really likes all the buttons in the lift. Oh. 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 oh dear, all that button pushing has broken the lift. Whoopsie, George. Don't worry, George. I'm a bit of an expert at lifts, you know. Ah. Uh, the buttons in the lift aren't working. Hello. Welcome to the lift. <gasps> Is this lift magic? No. It's voice activated, which means we just have to tell it where to go. Much easier. Oh. <clears throat> Hello, lift. We would like to go to my office, please. The lift is working again. Yay! Okay. Floor two. Office of bees. But it hasn't <laughs> taken them to Daddy Pig's office. <laughs> no, not office of bees. Office, please. Floor six. <laughs> office cheese. <laughs> mm, I love cheese. <laughs> I said office. <laughs> Floor 16. A fish. <laughs> Silly magic lift. <sighs> the lift doesn't seem to understand Daddy Pig's voice. I'll try. Can we go to Daddy's job? Now arriving at the top. Um. Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> Not the top. Daddy's job, please. Peppa and her family keep trying to get to Daddy Pig's office, but the magic <gasps> lift takes them to the wrong floors. Oi! <laughs> and spooky <gasps> floors. And even party floors. Oh. <laughs> but none of them are the right floor until <gasps> my office. Hooray! <laughs> Hello, Mummy Pig. We just had a little trouble with the lift. Be there soon. <laughs> Pepper and George really love the magic lift. Ah ah ah! But Daddy Pig much prefers to take the stairs. <laughs> Today, Peppa and George have come to play in a special bouncy maze. We're in a bit of a rush. So quick as you can, please. Yay! Bye, Bye Mummy! And don't get lost. The first room has a big bouncy castle inside. Nay! Hello! <laughs> Sorry, we can't play. We're in a bit of a rush. Come on, George. Peppa has gone through the blue exit. But George has gone through the red one by mistake. 
This room has a soft tunnel with Susie Sheep inside. Hi, Susie. Me and George have to go fast because we're in a rush. Oh. <laughs> Bye. Oh, George. This room is extra bouncy. Hi, Rebecca. Is this the way out? We're in a rush. Yes. <laughs> Through there. <laughs> Wee. <laughs> Done, Pepper. But where's George? Uh, I thought he was behind me. Maybe he's lost in the maze. <gasps> lost? We have to find him. Whee! George isn't lost. He's just having lots of fun. <laughs> Do you know where George is? No. He went that way! <laughs> but Mummy Pig is not as good at bouncing as Pepper. We're coming, George! <laughs> oh. It's okay, Mummy. Falling is just as fun as bouncing. Whee! Whee! <laughs> hmm. um. <gasps> there he is! We're coming, George! <laughs> Whoa! Whee! Oh, <laughs> Hooray! We found you! Phew! It's time for us to go home! No! George doesn't want to go home. He's having lots of fun in the bouncy maze. Well, then we'll have to come and get you! <laughs> Peppa and George love playing in the bouncy maze. <laughs> Got you. I won't ever lose you again. Look out below. Whee! <laughs> <laughs> now we really have to go. And so does <laughs> Mummy Pig. Today, Peppa and Mummy Pig are riding the bumper cars yeah. at Potato City. Can't catch me, Rebecca. <laughs> oh, yes, I can. <laughs> A new ride! It's a water ride! <laughs> it's so splashy! I love splashy rides! <laughs> splashy? Mummy Pig isn't sure she loves splashy rides. Uh, why don't we go on a ride <laughs> without splashes? Like uh, this bench! Ooh, what fun! Whee! <laughs> we can go on that after. Come on, Mummy! <laughs> Everyone has arrived at the new water ride. Celery Stick Falls. Uh-oh! Stop! <laughs> oh, it is very splashy. Very, very splashy. <laughs> Adults in the front, please. That means you, Mummy Pig, right here. Oh, right. Um, OK. Enjoy the ride. <laughs> oh. oh, this is quite lovely. The ride is going very high up. Splash, splash, splash. We all love to splash. Oh, uh, not everyone loves to splash. Yoo-hoo! <laughs> <laughs> Would you like a small splash, a big splash, or a humongous splash? Um, a humongous splash, please! Yeah! yeah. No. Okie dokie. Ready? Yeah. yeah! No. Five against one. Off you go! The celery stick falls are very fast. And very splashy. There we are, nice and dry. Oh, not again! Yay! <laughs> Yay! That was amazing! <laughs> and very, very splashy! Mummy, what are you doing? 
The splashes were... Amazing! Let's go again! Now Mummy Pig loves humongous splashes. Everyone loves humongous splashes. Today, Mummy Pig has brought Peppa and George for a special <laughs> visit to the toy shop. Hello! I'm looking for a mummy and two little ones for a special toy shop treat. Have you seen them? <gasps> That's us! Is it? Well, what are you waiting for? Let's go! Hooray! Oh! This Whoa. is where you're able to create your very own special toy. Ooh! Just swipe through to choose. You could pick a robot or a princess or a silly monster or a... <gasps> dinosaur! <laughs> oh, I didn't know you liked dinosaurs. Dinosaur! 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 <laughs> George loves dinosaurs. They're his favourite. I guess we know what he'll be making. Have fun! Yay! Ooh, <laughs> good choice. <laughs> Lovely. <laughs> a spaceman. A monster. A superhero. Pepper and George <laughs> love making their own toys. They both like very different things. Mine is a robot. Dinosaur! Fantastic! Now with a little toy shop magic... <laughs> The machine will make oh. your toys! Lovely! <laughs> now, you just need to pick an outfit for your toys. <laughs> there are lots of different outfits to choose from, but Peppa and George think oh. these outfits are perfect for their new toys. <laughs> Hooray! <gasps> perfect! In they go! Oh dear, the toy machine has put the wrong clothes on the toys. The machine mixed up their clothes, Miss Rabbit. <laughs> oh, yes. Oh, well, they still look like fun toys to me. And very creative. Flight <laughs> <laughs> egg is fun. Whee! <laughs> Wait for us, Peppa. Whee! Wow, what is this room? This is a special new toy machine. Whoa. Just stand here in the middle, Peppa. <laughs> what is it doing? Stay still! What was that? <gasps> Ta -da! The machine has made a little toy that looks just <laughs> like Pepper. Look, George, I'm tiny! <laughs> Whee! <gasps> and so are you! <laughs> Pepper and George love making toys in the toy shop, but George really loves being a toy too. <laughs> Hello! Peppa and her family are ordering lunch at a sandwich shop. Peppa, we don't order at the counter in this sandwich shop. No. We yes. order at the special screens. Oh, <laughs> sorry. Why don't you have a go at ordering a sandwich, Peppa? <laughs> Ooh! <laughs> You can select different toppings for your baguette by pressing the pictures. I'm very hungry. <laughs> I want a really big, long baguette, please. Lettuce, tomato and lot of cheese! Pepper is adding lots of cheese and her sandwich is getting bigger and bigger. I know you're hungry. Pepper. But that might be a bit too much cheese. Oh, <laughs> OK. Now press the send button so the chef can make your order. The chefs have received Pepper's order from the machine <laughs> and are hard at work making it. It looks so yummy and cheesy. Now it's George's turn to pick his sandwich. <laughs> Look, that children's meal comes with a special surprise. Surprise! Aha! <laughs> George can't wait for his special surprise. Now it's Mummy Pig's turn to order. I'll just have my usual. 
Tomato and mushroom with six pickled onions, two cheese slices, olives, no cucumber, half a red pepper, and a sprinkle of chili sauce and a whole wheat poppy seed baguette. Um, did you say cucumber? Supply! No, no! Oh. George, no! Supply! Uh oh! George, no! I suppose it's always good to try new things. Pepper and George are enjoying their lunch while they wait for Mummy's extra special sandwich. It's very cheesy. <gasps> Dinosaur! Surprise! Mummy Pig's sandwich is being made. It's a bit bigger than she expected. Uh... It's ready, Mummy. Oh, how, um, big. I don't think I can eat all this on my own. Would you like some? Oh, it's a bit spicy. Mmm, but very tasty. Mm, I might have a new favourite. Everyone <laughs> loves their sandwiches, even if they aren't exactly what they meant to order. Four tickets, please. Four popcorns, please. Four drinks, please. <laughs> Today, Peppa and her family are at the cinema. Peppa's favourite book has been made into a movie. <laughs> Silly George, we're not seeing that scary ghost movie. Ours is really fun and not scary. Scary. Scary ghost <laughs> movies are only for grown-ups. Uh, oh, excuse me. Excuse Sorry. me. Oh. Uh, oh. Sorry. <sighs> <sighs> the seats in the cinema all fold up when they're not being used. But George's seat is folding up when he's sitting in it. Excuse me. Coming through. Watch your toes. Luckily, Miss Rabbit has a special booster to hold the seat flat. <laughs> Thank you, Miss Rabbit. No problem. Me again. <gasps> Who spilled popcorn? <laughs> George doesn't like it when the cinema gets dark. Whish, whish. Yay, it's starting. <gasps> <laughs> George doesn't like the loud sounds either. <gasps> it's the baddie. Yeah, oh dear. George thinks the baddie in the movie is a bit scary. Maybe we should take George outside. But you can't miss the movie. Oh. Pepper has thought of a way to make the baddie less scary for George. Hello, George. It's me. I'm just pretending to be a buddy for the movie. I'm not really scary. Not scary? No. And this magic wand oh. will keep you extra safe. Wish! <laughs> Wish! <laughs> Plus, at the end of the story, everyone lives happily ever after. Ooh, happy! <laughs> Whoosh! Shh! <gasps> Sorry! Everyone <laughs> loves going to the cinema, and George really loves movies with happy endings. Today, Peppa and her friends are going to the sweet shop. Hello, Miss Rabbit. I'd like to buy everything in the sweet shop, please. Here is my coin. Peppa and her friends each have one coin to buy a sweet with. Here is my coin, too. And mine. And mine. Wow, what a lot of money. But I'm afraid it's not enough to buy everything in the shop. <laughs> oh, yes. <laughs> One coin is perfect for trying my new sweet-making machines, though. Ooh. 
Just choose a machine, pop your coin in the slot and push the big red button. Mmm, strawberry laces. Nay, but strawberries are fruits, not sweets. My sweets are made with delicious real fruit. Much tastier and much healthier. <laughs> Yummy strawberries. They look like hair. <laughs> You're right. I've got a strawberry ponytail. <laughs> <laughs> my turn, my turn. Emily Elephant has found a rainbow lollipop machine. For this machine, you have to push the buttons to choose your favourite fruity flavours. Hmm. Yellow banana. Ooh, you love red apples. And pink raspberries. And blue blueberries. And green apples. <laughs> <laughs> you like all the flavours. <laughs> So fruity! <laughs> Look, it's a big binning ball. <laughs> That's a candy floss machine. Why don't you pop your coin in and give it a go? Mm, it tastes like coconut. <laughs> it looks just like you, Susie. And now it looks even more like you. <laughs> <gasps> what is that? Only one way to find out. But I thought this was a sweetie machine, not a money machine. <gasps> Can I use this to buy some real sweeties? You don't need to. That coin is a sweetie pepper. It's a chocolate coin. Chocolate! Hooray! Pepper loves a sweet treat from the sweet shop. Everyone loves a sweet treat from the sweet shop. Hooray! <laughs> oh. oh. Aha! There's one. Hooray! Today, Pepper and her family have come to the shopping centre. Oh. Perhaps we'll get out here. I'll park up and find you soon. <laughs> if I can find a space. They've come to the toy shop to find a gift for baby Alexander. There's so many toys. <laughs> Yay! Now, what do we think baby Alexander will like? Hmm. <gasps> Maybe this basketball. Or this blaster. Pop, pop. <laughs> or this karaoke machine. <laughs> karaoke! <laughs> <laughs> These are very fun, but I'm not sure they're right for a baby. Then we'll have to keep looking. <laughs> hmm. <laughs> Whee! <laughs> Daddy Pig has finally found a space in the car park. Ah. Oh dear. But the parking space is so small, he can't get out of the car. I'll just have to go around again. Whee! Whee! <laughs> what have you found, George? It's like the car park we were in. Car park! <laughs> George loves the toy car park. Baby Alexander does like cars, but I think he is too <laughs> young for this toy. Oh! What about this ball, George? No! Up! 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 <laughs> or maybe this cuddly teddy? No! Whee! George doesn't think any of these toys are right for Baby Alexander. <laughs> what about this noisy rattle? <laughs> <laughs> boom, boom. George only <gasps> likes the toy car park. Hmm. <laughs> Look at <gasps> this, George. No. <laughs> for you. What a perfect gift for baby Alexander. 
We'll take it, please, Miss Rabbit. <laughs> I wonder where Daddy Pig parked. Whee! Hello, everyone. <laughs> everyone loves going toy shopping. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> but Daddy and George really love the car park. Whee! <laughs> <laughs> Hi. Today, Peppa is going to Rebecca Rabbit's bar. Bye, Mummy! Oh. <laughs> <clears throat> Today, Peppa is already at Rebecca Rabbit's burrow. She's come to play a new Whoa. video game called... Carrot Catcher! Do you want to play? <gasps> yes, please. I'm amazingly, really excellent at games. Oh, dear. Peppa doesn't know how to begin the game. Um, I am amazingly really excellent at games, but maybe it would be more fun if you started the game, Rebecca. <laughs> oh, yes, I knew that. <laughs> First, you pick your bunny. Then you hop around and catch the carrots. Oh, yes. Um... Uh. Peppa is amazingly really excellent at video games, but she might need a bit of help with this one. Uh, how do you catch the carrots, please, Rebecca? Like this! <gasps> Yay! I'm good at this. <laughs> oh. My turn! <laughs> Wow! Rebecca Rabbit is amazingly really excellent at this game. Wow! You're really good at catching carrots, Rebecca. <laughs> I've had lots of practice. Do you want to play together now? We can be a team. <gasps> yes! Woohoo! <laughs> Got it! Yay! Here's one! There's one! Whee! <laughs> New high score! Hooray! Peppa and Rebecca make a very good team. Rosie! Robbie! What are you doing? <laughs> Hello, you two! Have you seen the twins? They've run off with our lunch! <gasps> we'll catch them! We're good at catching carrots! And baby bunnies! <laughs> <laughs> Found one! Rosie! <laughs> gotcha! Here's another one! Robbie! Got it! Mm, still good! Peppa and Rebecca are very good carrot catchers. Yay! Hooray! Lunch is safe! <laughs> <See> you! <laughs> In fact, Peppa and Rebecca are amazingly, really excellent carrot catchers. Tonight, Mummy and Daddy Pig are going out for a Valentine's Day meal. Uh -huh. Mummy Pig has ordered a taxi. <gasps> it's almost here! Hooray! Oh. Your ride awaits, madam. <gasps> oh, um. um. Mummy Pig has accidentally ordered a special taxi called a limousine. <laughs> a limo? How romantic! And Whoa. tickly. <laughs> Where are we off to, sirs and madams? Granny and Grandpa Pig's house, if you please, Miss Rabbit. Pepper and George are going there for dinner. Dinner! <laughs> <laughs> okay, calm down, you two. Ah, <sighs> oh, this music reminds me of Venice. <laughs> what a wonderful trip that was. <gasps> We didn't have this in Venice. <laughs> Aww. <laughs> Care for a oh. chocolate, Mummy Pig? <laughs> oh, don't mind if I can. Can we have some, Daddy? Chocolate! <laughs> um, 
Okay, but not too many. Peppa and George love chocolate. <laughs> Maybe a little too much. <laughs> I guess I'll have this one then. <laughs> Can we have the disco music again? Just until Granny and Grandpa's house, please. <laughs> oh. Grandpa Pig. Everyone <laughs> loves celebrating Valentine's Day, but Mummy and Daddy Pig love their disco limo ride most of all. Huh. Uh. 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 Wow! Today, Peppa and her family are visiting the arcade. got a high score. That's because Peppa and I are experts at all of these games. Look at all these tokens, Peppa. If you collect lots of these, you can trade them in for a huge prize. Wow, a prize? Squeak! Look at all these tokens. <laughs> can we play that game next? Of course, Peppa. Mummy Pig is showing Peppa how to play Carrot Bop. She is bopping the carrots whenever they pop up. Bop! 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 <laughs> Would you both like to have a go? Yes, please! Bop! Bop! Daddy? Daddy? <laughs> Daddy Pig is playing the dancing game. Daddy Pig loves dancing. Wow. I'm a bit of an expert at dancing, you know. Your turn, Pepper. <laughs> I know just the game. <laughs> Peppa and her family are playing a balloon game. Whoever fills their balloon with water first wins. Yay! Did we get another high score? Yes, your score was so high that you have all won the jackpot. Now you can trade in all your tokens for a huge prize. Let's go! Hello again, Peppa. Here are all our tokens. Can we please have our prize? Of course. With this many tokens, you can get a marvellous, extraordinary, one-of-a-kind pencil. Hooray! A pencil! Peppa loves winning lots of tokens with her family at the arcade. And Peppa really loves her brand new pencil. Today, Peppa and her classmates are visiting a chocolate factory. Can I try some chocolate, please, Miss Rabbit? You can, Peppa. Yay! But we've got to make it first. Oh. <laughs> Peppa is very excited to make chocolate. How do we make it, Miss Rabbit? With this machine. Hello, machine. Can you make me some chocolate, please? <gasps> Thank you, machine. Yay! 
Now can I try some of it, please? Not yet, Peppa. We need to decorate it first. Follow me! Hooray! Everyone is very excited to decorate the chocolate, too. You can decorate one chocolate bar each. Ooh, it looks like a muddy puzzle. <laughs> yes, but don't jump in it, Peppa. And you can add whatever decorations you like from the table as long as it's yummy. Mine is a carroty chocolate bar. <laughs> Squeak! Delicious! Mine is a cheesy chocolate bar. Squeak! Yum, yum! And mine is a spaghetti chocolate bar. Oh. Because strawberry laces look like spaghetti. <laughs> Phew! Scrumptious! Can I try some chocolate now, please, Miss Rabbit? Almost, Peppa. The chocolate needs to cool in the fridge first. The fridge is very cold and makes the liquid chocolate oh. harden into bars. And done. <laughs> oh. Can we please try some chocolate now, Miss Rabbit? Not yet, Pep. Oh, wait. Yes, you can. <gasps> Something wrong, Peppa? No, I just really liked it when the chocolate was all runny like a muddy puddle. Ho oh, oh. ho! Then it's lucky I have one more treat for you Yay! all. It's a chocolate fountain. It's just like a giant chocolate muddy puddle. And lots of nice healthy fruit to dip too. Thank you, Miss Rabbit. <laughs> Peppa loves muddy puddles, especially when they're made out of chocolate. <laughs> Today, Peppa and George are playing grown-ups. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. Where is my bag and my hat? We're off to work now, Mummy. <laughs> <laughs> oh, and what job do you think you'd enjoy when you're grown-up? George wants to be a dinosaur. Hmm. I think I would enjoy being a dentist. Then I will make sure everyone's teeth are nice and healthy. Hmm. Interesting. Uh, 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 all right. You've got lots of clean teeth, Mummy. Oh. Here's a sticker for being so brave. Don't forget to brush your teeth. Who's next? <laughs> Silly George. Dinosaurs don't go to the dentist. <laughs> they go to Dr Hamster the vet. <laughs> but you can have a sticker anyway. <laughs> I think you'd make a very good dentist. Dinosaur! <laughs> and you'd be an excellent dinosaur, George. But I'd also like to be a bus driver. Then I could take all my friends to the park. Tickets, please. Next stop, <laughs> the park. Stop! <gasps> You forgot us! Come back! <laughs> vroom! Vroom! <laughs> <laughs> you have to stop at all the bus stops if you want to be a bus driver, Peppa. Oops, <gasps> sorry. <laughs> <laughs> I think you'd be a brilliant bus driver, Peppa. But I don't just want to be a dentist and a bus driver. I also want to be a teacher. Oh. Then I'll teach everybody how to paint. You can paint a butterfly using handprints like this. <gasps> Dinosaurs don't go to school, George. Perhaps you could open a school for dinosaurs. 
But when I'm grown up, I also want to jump in muddy puddles. <laughs> <laughs> and George will be a dinosaur. And they will always love jumping in muddy puddles, <laughs> even when they are grown up or dinosaurs. Today, Peppa and Susie are playing in the treehouse. Oh, hello, Susie. Do come along in. How awfully, terribly kind. They're pretending to be grown-ups. We should have a big, delicious cuppa. Gosh, we are having lots of weather, aren't we? <gasps> Someone is at the door. Sorry to interrupt. Your oh. mummy is here to take you home, Susie. Aww. But we were going to have a tea party like grown-ups. Can we have a sleepover in the treehouse, Grandpa? Please? Oh, um... Of course <laughs> you can. You and Susie can sleep in the treehouse and Grandpa Pig and I will camp out here to look after you. Hooray! <laughs> Peppa and Susie are Yay! very excited to have a sleepover in the treehouse. Here are your sleeping bags, oh. <laughs> pillows, <laughs> Lots of cuddly toys. <laughs> and the best bit? A special starry lantern. Wow! wow. Ta-da! <laughs> All finished. Oh. Huh. Suppose I don't need these. Grandpa Pig is excited to sleep in the tent Whoa. too. Whoa! Ah, or perhaps I do. Once he uh. has rebuilt it. <gasps> <laughs> It is bedtime now, so Granny and mm. Grandpa Pig are going to their tent. Good night, you two. We're just here if you need us. <laughs> <gasps> Look, Susie. My shadow's really big. Ooh. <laughs> Mine is a bird. Tweet, tweet. And mine is a butterfly. <laughs> Everything okay? There was a really loud noise. Gosh! Hmm. Hmm. Ah! Oh, my goodness! Is it a monster? Oh. Hmm? Oh. oh. <laughs> no monsters here. Just Grandpa <gasps> Pig snoring. Peppa and Susie love sleeping oh. in the treehouse. What's, what's all this then? Oh, dear. <laughs> Even with Grandpa Pig snoring next door. Today, Peppa and her family are at the supermarket. They're going to pay for their shopping at the wow. till. <gasps> huh? Sorry, got to nip to the loo. Use the self-checkout if you like. <laughs> the self-checkout lets you scan and pay for your shopping all by yourself. It's a big shopping <laughs> robot. Would you two like to scan the shopping? Yes, please. <laughs> Hello, customers. Hello, shopping robots. Please place bags in the bagging area. Um... Bag! <laughs> yes, George. Mummy's handbag is a bag. This bag is the wrong bag. <laughs> the shopping robot needs shopping bags. This bag is the right bag. Yay! Please scan shopping. Beep. Peppa and George like scanning the shopping. <laughs> Item not scanned. Try again. Oh, um, beep. Item still not scanned. Try again. There is a rather long queue waiting to use the shopping robot. Item not scanned. Mm, it's not working. Item not scanned. Item not scanned. <laughs> item, 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 items scanned. Yay! Please put ten cartons of juice in the bagging area. Ten? We don't need that much juice. Um, cancel juice. More juice <gasps> added. Please put 60 
cartons of juice no, in the bagging pencil, area. Pencil. Hmm. Oh, this should do it. Oh. Oh. Mummy Pig is very good with computers and shopping robots. How do we beat this, Mummy? The pineapple doesn't have a little sticker to scan. We have to find it on the screen. Oh. Pine cones? No. Pine nuts? No. Ah, pineapple. Here we go. Yay! <laughs> Item is too light. Oh. Um, how about... No! <laughs> Item too heavy. Error, 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 error. This one. Error. How about no? And no. Stop! Press the button on the side. Everyone in the supermarket is trying to help. Too many errors. Shopping robot is broken. Sorry, everyone, I'm back. Who's next? Me, 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 me. 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 <sighs> oh, terrific! Everyone loves going shopping. Please scan oh. shopping. But not everyone loves the shopping robot. <laughs> Today, Peppa and George are at a fun fair. <laughs> Hi, Peppa. Have you been in the fun house yet? What's a fun house? It's a special fun fair house that has lots of silly rooms and funny hallways. <laughs> Can me and George go into the fun house, please? Please. Hello, Miss Rabbit. Two for the fun house. To enter the fun house, Mummy Pig must buy tokens from Miss um... Rabbit. But the tokens cost more coins than Mummy Pig thought. Oh. Thank you, Mummy Pig. Right this way. <laughs> Hooray! Ooh! This is the rickety rackety bridge. Pass through to see the rest of the fun house. <laughs> Peppa is moving very slowly and carefully across the bridge. But George thinks it's fun to go very fast. <laughs> Your way is much better, George. Whee! <laughs> Congratulations! Now you need to follow the arrows. This way, George. <laughs> These mirrors are so wobbly. The funhouse mirrors make Peppa and George look very silly indeed. This mirror makes me look so tall. And you look like you have a very big head, George. <laughs> that one makes you look really round. Round! And this mirror makes me look like Miss Rabbit. That's because I am Miss Rabbit. <gasps> <laughs> Follow me to the twisty, turny tunnel. <laughs> the funhouse tunnel spins round and round. Ooh! And it's very windy. <laughs> Look! After the tunnel, we get to go down the slide. Yay! <laughs> I'll help you, George. <laughs> I wonder what's taking so long. I hope they're not lost. <laughs> How was it? The fun house was really fun. How fitting. Everyone loves the fun house because the fun house is very... Peppa Pig and her friends are at the aquarium today. <laughs> they're all pretending to be fish. <laughs> This is an octopus. It has eight long, wibbly-wobbly legs. Ooh. Actually, an octopus only has two wibbly-wobbly legs. The other six are wibbly-wobbly arms. Rip, wobble, rip, wobble, rip, wobble, rip, wobble. <laughs> Wow! I wish I had a rainbow tail. <gasps> Let's be mermaids, Susie. <laughs> but we don't have mermaid tails. But 
dance, we can pretend! <laughs> <laughs> Hooray! Peppa Whee! and Susie are pretending they are mermaids with long, lovely tails. Hello, seahorses! We can swim around just like you! <laughs> Whee! Whee! <gasps> it's so pretty! What is it? This is an oyster. It has a pearl inside. <gasps> a pearl? What's a pearl? It's a very lovely shiny object. Can we open it and see it? An oyster only opens when it's ready, so we'll just have to be patient. Hmm. I can't see the pearl. Excuse me, Mr Oyster. Can you open, please? We're being really patient. Can you go, ah, uh, like at the dentist? Hmm. Um. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's not working. <gasps> it's so tickly. <laughs> Let's tickle it open. Mermaid Pepper and Mermaid Susie are trying to tickle the oyster so it'll open. They tickle. And tickle, and tickle, but the oysters still won't open. It's not working. We'll never see the pearl. We'll just have to wait. <gasps> it's the pearl. It's so pretty. <laughs> the oyster has finally opened. The pearl inside is very lovely indeed. Rip-wob! But I want to see the pearl. Can we make it open, please? <laughs> no, Danny. Oh. We have to be patient. Everyone knows that being patient can be tricky, but Peppa and Susie know that the very lovely pearl will be worth the wait. Hooray! Today, Peppa is playing with her toy blocks. Careful, George. This is a very small town Whoa. and you're a very giant <laughs> dinosaur. That gives me an idea. Do you want to play giants, George? <laughs> George is very excited to play giants with Pepper. Hello, Police Officer Panda. What a lovely, quiet, normal day in Toyland. <laughs> and definitely no sign of... <gasps> Hello, I am Giant Pepper. <gasps> A giant! Two giants! <laughs> Pepper and George are imagining their giants in a pretend <laughs> toy block world. Hello, birds! Hello, clouds! <laughs> We can help you with that. We are very tall giants. <gasps> <laughs> Whoopsie. <laughs> oh, careful, George. <laughs> there you go, Susie. Hooray! Giant Pepper and Giant George love to help their friends in Toyland. <gasps> They help the passengers Whee! to get on the bus. Oh, wee! 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 <laughs> and help the boats go very, very fast. <laughs> Stop! <gasps> it's the bridge you broke earlier. Oh. Don't worry. We can fix it. <laughs> Peppa and George are experts with toy blocks. They fix the toy bridge in no time at all. Thanks, Giant Peppa and Giant George. Stop! Uh, I mean, go! Hooray! 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 Oh, goody! Yay! Hi, Kate. I'm hungry too. 
The food in Toyland is too small for Giant Pepper and Giant George. Whoa! Dinner time! Hooray! So they will have to have real food instead. Careful, George! <laughs> Today is Pancake Day. So Pepper and her family are eating at a fancy pancake restaurant. Ooh. I'll be your chef today. Oh. I make the pancakes right at your table Whoa. and you get to help. What kind of pancakes can we make? Any you can think of. We have lots of yummy ingredients. I'll have the special mushroom pancake, please. One banana-licious banana pancake with extra bananas for me, please. Coming right up. <laughs> Miss Rabbit is good at making pancakes. Yay! <laughs> Thank you. Now a little colour. Then add the mushrooms. Bananas and extra bananas. Ooh! And now for the best bit. Smelling? Eating? Yeah! Flipping it! Exactly! Woohoo! Miss Rabbit is very good at making pancakes. Whoa! Ha! <laughs> Ta da! <laughs> <laughs> Yay! Mmm! Phew! Now, what would you two like in your pancakes? I would like a chocolatey chocolate pancake. With chocolate, please! <laughs> you clearly have a sweet tooth. And you, George? <laughs> oh. Peas and tomato for George. And pineapple, coconut, cabbage. Hmm. And this. No, that's oh. red hot chilli. Peppa. <laughs> Peppa and George like all kinds of ingredients on their pancakes and lots of them. Yay! Want to help me flip? Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> now, on the count of three, we'll give them a gentle little flip. One, two... Flip! Pepper and George have flipped their pancakes Whoa! very high and onto <laughs> Mr Bull's plate. Oh, yummy! Mmm! Tore very much! Mmm! It's sweet! Mm, and savoury, crunchy, and ooh, spicy, oh. ooh, delicious. Oh. <laughs> it's a special surprise pancake. Oh. Mm. Okay. Peppa and George love making super special surprise oh. pancakes. Looks like we'll have to make another for you two. Yay! Yay! <laughs> but they really love eating them when they're done. Come on, Team Supermarket. I've got the trolley. I've got the shopping list. Dinosaur! Hooray! Today, Peppa and her family are at the supermarket. <laughs> Mummy, we've gone past all the food. <laughs> Why is your bag so noisy? <laughs> We're here! <laughs> Wow! We're using a special part of the supermarket today called the refill station. But how do we carry the food? Aha! With these! At the <laughs> refill station, everyone brings their own containers and fills them up with food. OK, team. Daddy and I will read out the shopping list. Pepper and George, you can fill the containers. <gasps> Ready? Yes! yes. <laughs> Once we're done, your prize will be lunch! Yay! Off we go! Your first item is rice. Found it! George, we need something to put the rice in. Oh. <laughs> um, that's an egg box, George. Oh dear. Peppa and George have put rice in the egg box. Next, please. Oh, uh, cereal. Isn't that a milk bottle? It's perfect, George. Oh, we only spilt a little bit. <laughs> Thanks.
Thanks for cleaning, dinosaur. Next is milk. Oh. The milk bottle has already been used for cereal, so no one's sure what to put the milk in. Mm. George thinks they should use the ah! juice carton instead. Good idea, George. <laughs> Next. Next is um orange juice. Ah, oh. Pepper and George have just put milk in the juice carton. We'll have to use the rice bag, George. <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> wibbly wobbly, wibbly wobbly. Last on the list is pasta. Ooh. Go! <laughs> what? Guess we're having lots of pasta this week. <laughs> now it's time to take the shopping to the till and pay for it. What have you got there? We've got an egg box of rice, a milk bottle of cereal, a juice carton of milk, a sack of pasta and a bag of oh. orange juice. <laughs> the usual then. Dinosaur! <laughs> oh, and George's dinosaur had some cereal off the floor. <laughs> <laughs> Today, Peppa and her class are going on a school trip. Hello, everyone. Who's ready for a school trip in my lovely new yellow bus? Ooh. Oh, what happened to your old blue bus, Miss Rabbit? It broke down at the weekend whilst I was taking a nice relaxing drive. Oh dear, Miss Rabbit's bus is unable to race. So it's in the garage for some small repairs. That bus is going to need some big repairs. <laughs> Peppa and her friends have never been on a big yellow bus before. Seatbelt check. Check. <laughs> then off we go. <laughs> Whoops. Let's try again. Miss Rabbit isn't used to driving the yellow bus. <laughs> The yellow bus is a bit fast for Madame Gazelle. Miss Rabbit, can the yellow bus play music? The yellow bus can do lots of things. It can do this, this, oh. this, oh. and of course, this. The yellow bus can play music very loudly. Could we turn the music down a little bit? Of course, Madame Gazelle. Aww. Why don't we sing a song instead? The yellow bus wheels go round and round. Round and round, round and round. round, and round. The yellow bus wheels go round, round and round all day long. Play I Spy. Good idea. I spy with my little eye something beginning with R. Road. Nope. Uh, rabbit. Nope. It's a really big lorry. Oh. Hello, Mr. Ball. Hello. Peppa's playgroup have arrived for their school trip, so it's time to get off the bus. Oh! I wish we could stay on the yellow bus all day. Don't worry, I'll be back in the bus to take you all home later. Everyone likes riding in the big yellow bus. Everyone except Madame Gazelle. <laughs> Are volcanoes real, Madame Gazelle? They are. Ooh. But do not worry, children. There are no volcanoes close by. Hooray! Except the little pretend ones that we are going to make for today's very special science experiment. Oh. We will make our volcanoes using glue and newspaper. Like this. First, you dip the paper in the glue. 
and then you stick it all to the beaker, and voila! A volcano! Everyone is enjoying making their volcanoes. The glue is very sticky and messy. <laughs> and soon they are all finished. <laughs> Wonderful, children! Now it is time to paint your creations. <laughs> Let's make ours red, Peppa. Ours can be blue! blue. Green, like a big tree. Real volcanoes are dark and grey with red lava. But Peppa and her friends are making their mini volcanoes bright and colourful. <laughs> now it is time for the science experiment. But first, everyone must put on special gloves, glasses and coats to make sure they are safe. You all look like wonderful scientists, children. Now we are ready to make lava. <gasps> but do not worry. The lava we are making is just pretend and very safe. <laughs> First, we add some vinegar to our volcanoes. Be careful not to spill. Uh, uh, <gasps> Perfect. And now I will add a secret magic ingredient to each of your volcanoes. Nobody knows what the special magic ingredient is. Finally, take your cup of baking soda and pour a little inside the volcano. Then stand back. Madame Gazelle's volcano is erupting just like a real volcano. Your turn, children. Hooray! <laughs> wow! The lava is red. Ours <laughs> is blue. Candy Cat and what? Gerald Giraffe's lava is green and very foamy. Yeah. I think we made too much lava. No, Candy. You made a muddy puddle. Everyone loves making volcanoes, but everyone really loves making colourful, muddy puddles. Today, Peppa and her family have been at the supermarket. Outside the supermarket is a toy machine. Yay! Ooh! Mandy Mouse has got a toy. Look, Mummy! A yo-yo! Well done, Mandy. Peppa, George, would you like a go on the toy machine? Yes, please. How does it work, Miss Rabbit? You just buy a token and put it in the slot. Then a ball rolls all the way down to the bottom of the machine and there's a <laughs> special surprise toy inside. Dinosaur! George would like to get a dinosaur toy. How fun! You can have one try each. Here you go. Yay! <laughs> Yay! George's token makes the machine light up and play music. A ball rolls all the way down to the bottom. Whoa! Dinosaur! Oh. George has got a toy screwdriver. A screwdriver! How useful! Dinosaur! Don't worry, George. I'll try to get the dinosaur too. Now, Peppa's token <laughs> makes the machine light up and a different ball rolls all the way down to the bottom. <laughs> oh. Peppa hasn't got the dinosaur, but she has got some very nice stickers. Dinosaur! What lovely toys you got. <gasps> but look, our ice cream is starting to melt. So close. I have a feeling the dinosaur will come out next time. <laughs> Please, can we have one more go, Mummy? Please? Oh, go on then. <laughs> one more try. Hooray! Peppa and George pull the lever on the toy machine. But this time, no balls pop out. Oh. Oh, dear. I wanted to see what toy you were going to get. Not to <gasps> worry, Mummy Pig. I can fix it. I just need to find my screwdriver. Nope. Nope. 
<gasps> oh. Ooh, diver. Ah, oh, thank you, George. <laughs> <gasps> Yay! Oh, whoops! <laughs> Miss Rabbit has fixed the machine too much. Now all the balls have fallen out. I'd better put these back, but I think you earned this for helping me fix the machine. <gasps> Dinosaur! <laughs> Thank you, Miss Rabbit. This is for you. Eh? <gasps> <laughs> Everyone loves the toy machine and George really loves dinosaurs. Today, Mummy and Peppa have brought George Yay! to the doctors for a checkup. Hello, I'm Dr Peppa Pig. <laughs> Hello, Dr Peppa Pig. I'm Nurse Miss Rabbit. <laughs> and this is Dr Brown Bear. Ready for your checkup, George? No! George <gasps> has never been to the doctors before. He is a little nervous. Don't worry, George. The doctors just want to make sure you feel good. Exactly. Come on in and don't forget your little red book. <laughs> First, Miss Rabbit and Dr Brown Bear need to check George's height. <gasps> Step this way, please, George. No! But George isn't sure he'll like the height measurer. <laughs> How tall am I, Miss Rabbit? Wow! You're getting very tall, Peppa. <gasps> You'll be a big grown-up soon. Mm -hmm. <laughs> George wants to know if he is very tall too. Wow! You're so big and tall, George. <laughs> <laughs> now it's time to check George's weight with a special machine called scales. This machine will tell us how much you weigh, George. And it's really good for bouncing. <laughs> George loves bouncing. <laughs> Mm hmm And unfreeze! <laughs> <laughs> now it's time to listen to George's heart with a special tool called a stethoscope. Oh. Oh. Mm. This might be a little cold. <laughs> the stethoscope is very cold. Oh! Try this, George. You can listen to my heartbeat too. George likes listening to Peppa's heart. <laughs> Yay! You did very well today, George. So you get a sticker. Oh. <gasps> <laughs> <laughs> and one for Dr Peppa Pig for being so helpful too. Hooray! <laughs> <laughs> Ready or not, here I come. Today, Peppa's family are playing a game of hide and seek. <laughs> Mummy Pig hmm. is the seeker. Aha! Uh -huh. oh. Found you! <laughs> oh no! <laughs> I guess I'll help you find Peppa and George now. <laughs> hmm. Ooh, uh, I just don't know where they could be. Hmm. <laughs> Let's try in the kitchen <laughs> by that fresh pot of tea. We did it, George. <gasps> We're the best hiders ever. Peppa and George are looking for a new hiding place. Ooh. Let's hide in the cupboard under the stairs. <laughs> this can be our secret hiding oh. room. <laughs> oh, where could they be, Daddy Pig? I don't think we'll ever find them. <laughs> Mummy and Daddy must be looking for us everywhere. <laughs> we'll just have to keep looking, Mummy Pig. They'll turn up. 
biscuit. Peppa and George stay hidden in the secret room for a little while. And then a long while. <laughs> and then a really long while. I don't think they'll ever find us. So we should get some toys so we don't get bored. Not, Not here. here. Not here. Or here. Or here. Keep looking. Or here. Keep looking. Pepper and George are getting lots of toys for their secret room. Hmm. Come out, come out, wherever you are. Oh, uh, where are you? Uh oh. <gasps> Whoa. Whoa. Ooh. Where did this come from? Daddy Pig, are you okay? <gasps> <laughs> Oh. Well, it's a good job it's your turn to hoover up. <laughs> there, much better. Dinosaur. <laughs> Where do you think Pepper and George are? Not under the stairs, that's for sure. Pepper and George must be the best hiders in the whole world. Everyone loves playing hide and seek, and Pepper and George really love their secret hiding place. Yummy, tasty food. Yummy, tasty Today on the cruise, Pepper and her family are at a very special type of restaurant. This is a special type of restaurant called a buffet. Just take a plate and choose the food you want to eat. Enjoy! Oh, oh goody! The restaurant mm. buffet has lots of different foods to choose from. What would you like to eat, Pepper? Spaghetti is my favourite. Right you are. But we mustn't take too much. We can always come back and get some more. Oh, good idea. <laughs> and what would you like, George? Juice! Thirsty, are you? <laughs> I think we can rustle up some orange <laughs> juice. Let's see here. Aha! Ooh. The orange juice machine is very loud. And it hasn't made very much orange juice at all. Oh. Juice! We'll just have to make some more. Delicious. I can't wait to... Finished. Oh. Mm. <laughs> you were hungry, Pepper. Can I get some more now, please? Oh. Of course. Let's go. Hooray! Grandpa Pig is still trying to make George a cup of orange juice. Oh, dear. Could we have some more oranges, please, Miss Rabbit? Right away. Ooh. Pepper has found a very special pancake machine. Just one pancake, please, Mr. Robot. I can always come back and get more. Mm -hmm. Splendid! Aha! Granny Pig is ah. very excited ah. to eat her spaghetti. Ah! Finish! Oh. Thank you, Pancake Robot. But now, Pepper is thirsty mm. too. Can I get some juice as well, Granny? Of course. Grandpa Pig can get you some. I do wonder what's ah. taking him so long. <gasps> Grandpa Pig has finally made a cup of orange juice. In fact, Grandpa Pig has made lots of cups of orange juice. Oh. The machine has finally stopped ah. making orange juice. Phew. Silly Grandpa, you don't need to make all the juice. You can always come back and get more. Pepper loves the buffet restaurant. Mm. And George really <laughs> loves orange juice. Come on. The fireworks are about to start. It's bonfire night. And Pepper is very excited. 
She thinks bonfires are lovely to look at. Wow! Well, hi, Peppa. You're just in time. The fireworks will begin in five, four, three, two, one. The fireworks are going so high. Whoa. Peppa thinks fireworks are very noisy. The fireworks are really loud, Grandpa. Oh, dear. Why don't we go further back? They'll be quieter if they're far away. We're going to the back, where the fireworks won't be so loud. Good idea. We'll come too. Excuse me, please. Us again. Oh, sorry. <gasps> Is that better, Peppa? Um, yes. Thank you, Danny. Great. Now we all can enjoy how nice the fireworks look. There's so many colours. Red and blue. And green. Oh, and yellow. Peppa is having lots of fun Yay! watching the fireworks. And now it's time for the big fireworks. Hold on to your hats, everyone. Bigger? Does that mean louder? <laughs> oh, my. What should we do? We can't go any further back. We'll have to go home. But I want to see the fireworks. I just don't want to hear them. Well, I know. Ah. Sometimes my granddad's garage is really loud too. So I use these. Headphones? Yes. Ooh. They cover your ears and make loud sounds more quiet. Do you want to try them? <gasps> wow! That's much better! Thank you, Danny! <laughs> no need to shout, Peppa. We can't hear the fireworks. <laughs> <laughs> Who's ready for an adventure to the seaside? Hooray! Yay! Peppa and her family are going out for the day. Oh dear, I think I forgot to put petrol in the car. Never mind. Let's take the train to the beach. Hooray! Peppa and her family are catching a train to the seaside. Tickets, please. We're going to the seaside. And Mummy didn't put petrol in the car. How exciting! <laughs> I love the seaside. I think it's time for some lunch. Peppa, <laughs> let's look for the dining carriage. <laughs> Whoa. Daddy Pig and Peppa are walking through the train Whoa. to the dining carriage. It is very wobbly. Ooh. Oh, this carriage must be for passengers who want to sleep. <laughs> Whoa. This carriage must be for people who want to play on the train. Wow. Hi, Danny. Hi, Gerald. <laughs> Whee! Uh-oh. Oh. Ah. This must be the cinema carriage. Excuse, Excuse me. me. Peppa and Daddy Pig have found the dining carriage. Ah. This carriage must be for people who want lunch. Is that your tummy rumbling, Daddy? I'm afraid the train has broken down. Oh dear, we'll have to take the bus. 
Now, Peppa's family are waiting to catch the bus uh, to the seaside. Uh -huh. Ah! All aboard! <laughs> Next stop, the seaside! Hooray! <laughs> The bus has broken huh. down. I think somebody forgot petrol again. <laughs> now how will we get to the seaside? Well, we can walk. The seaside is just down the hill. This was the best trip to the seaside ever. I can't wait to see how we get back home. <gasps> <laughs> <laughs> It is bedtime, but George isn't sleeping, so neither are Peppa or Daddy Pig. What now? We've already read every bedtime story. There is one book we haven't read. I've been saving it for an emergency. The very long and very boring story to help sleepy pigs fall asleep. The very long and very boring story <laughs> to help sleepy pigs fall asleep? Yes, the very long and very boring story to help sleepy pigs fall asleep. Oh. <laughs> Dory! Once upon a time, there was a hero named... Super Peppa! <laughs> um, yes. Super Pepper. Whee! She spent all her days helping the people in her neighborhood. Uh -oh. <laughs> Until one day she heard about a jumping giant who wouldn't stop shaking the town. The giant won't stop jumping. I'll help you. Super Pepper found the jumping <laughs> giant. Dinosaur! Oh, yes, George, the jumping dinosaur. Super Pepper tried everything she could to stop the jumping dinosaur from jumping. Like asking him very politely? Yes. <laughs> uh, excuse me. It's the dinosaur, sir. Excuse me. They tried some bedtime music. This will put him to sleep. <sighs> so relaxing. But the music only gave the dinosaur more energy. Super Pepper tried giving the jumping dinosaur a warm bath. Oh! <laughs> Whoa! She tried giving him cozy pajamas. She even tried counting stars. One, two, three, four, five. That's everything we did. There's nothing left to try. The bedtime story has helped George fall asleep. Hooray! Thank you for your help, Peppa. Sweet dreams. Thank you, Daddy Bert. Now I'm not tired. Can you finish the story? <laughs> Today, Peppa is having a play date at home with Susie Sheep and Emily Elephant. George is also having a play date with Edmund Elephant and Richard Rabbit. Perhaps we should have arranged these playdates for different days. Cooey! Only us! Yay. Ah. <laughs> we'll come back later. <laughs> Let's make a castle out of blocks! Peppa and her friends have decided to play with colourful building blocks. But George and his friends have decided to play something a little noisier. A dinosaur! Run! George loves to play dinosaur. <laughs> Not too fast, George. Almost. Got it? 
there. <laughs> but George isn't being very careful. Pepper? Yep, I'm okay. <gasps> Our castle. Oh. oh dear, George feels very sorry for breaking Pepper's castle. It's okay. It was just an accident. Maybe it'd be nice to play all together. Yay! <laughs> <laughs> I know a game we can play. <gasps> Everyone helps Pepper set up the game. Phew. <laughs> oh. And George gives everyone special costumes. Finally, everyone is ready to play. Oh dear, we need help. Are there any brave knights here? Oh. Do you need help, Mrs. Queen? Don't worry, we'll stop them with magic. <laughs> Everyone loves having playdates with Pepper and George. Oh. Tomorrow, then. And everyone really loves playing all together. Today, Peppa and her family are going on the night train to a very far away seaside. It's bedtime now. We can play with the beach ball tomorrow at the beach. But I don't want to go to sleep. Well, we're not going to sleep yet. We're having a sleepover. Yay! Peppa and George <laughs> love sleepovers. Can we have a midnight feast? You need to have a midnight feast at a sleepover, Daddy. It's the rules. Right you are. Follow me. Hooray! <laughs> Everyone has come to the dining carriage to get the midnight feast. Hello. Oh. Hello. What would you like? We'd like a midnight feast, please. One. <gasps> midnight feast coming up. Here you go. Fruit and warm milk. Perfect before a good sleep. <laughs> <laughs> Thank, Thank you. you. Everyone tucks into their midnight feast, gives their teeth a good brush, and gets comfy in bed. Can we have a bedtime story? Oh, okay, Peppa. Just one story, and then sleep. Hooray! This is the story of the magic night train. Ooh! Once upon a time, there was a magic night train which didn't need train tracks because it could fly. <gasps> Yay! dream about a magical night train. Look, we arrived at the seaside. Peppa and her family have arrived at the very far away seaside and they all enjoyed their train sleepover. 
Peppa and Rebecca Rabbit are making a pillow fort today. Careful, don't fall on the fort. Almost got it. Whoa. Squeak. We did it. Now we need to decorate the inside. <sighs> hmm. Something else is missing. Oh, oh something, something to eat. eat. <laughs> <laughs> Mummy. What a beautiful pillow fort. Can we have something to eat, please? Of course. I'll be right back. Don't go anywhere. <laughs> <laughs> Let's pretend the pillow fort is really big inside. <laughs> wow. <laughs> <laughs> Catch, Peppa! <laughs> Let's pretend the floor is really bouncy, like a trampoline. Squeak! <laughs> it's so bouncy! <laughs> oh, no! The ball bounced over there. Let's bounce after it. This floor is green, so let's pretend it's squelchy! Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> but the ball isn't here, maybe over there. <laughs> <laughs> this room is blue, so let's pretend it's cold! <laughs> There's the ball! Hooray! L let's get out of here. Um, which way did we c come in? Peppa, where are you? We're lost in the pillow fort. I'll come get you. No, Mummy. The fort isn't built for grown-ups. <sniffs> oh, I can fit through anything. <sniffs> <sighs> Mummy Pig is stuck. Oh. <sighs> Mummy, your wiggles are breaking the fall. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> you. <laughs> All that pretending has made me even more hungry. Good thing I brought you some food. Now, we just need to find it under these pillows. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty cool, eh, Peppa? <laughs> Daddy, we're getting shoes for George, not you. Oh, yes. Today, George is <laughs> buying some new shoes. Hello, Miss Rabbit. We need some new shoes for George. <laughs> George's shoes are very old. Well, you're in luck. The shoe shop has lots oh. of shoes. We'll find George the perfect pair. Hooray! First, we need to measure your feet. Pop your foot in the <gasps> measurer, please. Miss Rabbit Whoa. is measuring George's feet <laughs> to help him find shoes that are the right size. Your feet are very small. That's because George is a baby. <laughs> no. George is not a baby. Follow oh. me. <laughs> oh. We keep all our very small shoes over here. Which shoes do you ah. like, George? Shoes. <laughs> Those are bowling shoes. George <laughs> loves to oh. go bowling. And he oh. loves bowling <laughs> shoes. Are you sure you want those shoes, George? <laughs> shoes! Shoes! Those are tap dancing uh -huh. shoes. Uh -huh. They're very noisy! <laughs> George loves to make lots of noise. Maybe too noisy! <laughs> George oh. loves clown <laughs> shoes. <Whoa. laughs> They're too big. And George is very small. Uh, 
George tries on lots of shoes. Tall ones. Little ones. And even silly ones. But none of them are quite right. are just like your old <gasps> shoes. Shoes! George would like <gasps> new shoes that are just <laughs> like his old shoes. Jolly good. We'll take them, please, Miss Rabbit. Miss Rabbit? Phew! I'm under here! Oh. Shoes! George <laughs> loves his new shoes and he loves the shoe shop. Everyone loves the shoe shop. Today, the cruise has stopped on an island, so Pepper and Granny Pig can go surfing. But there aren't any waves. Where did all the waves go? It looks like the water is too calm for surfing today, Pepper. You can help me and George collect shells instead, if you like. Shiny! Whee! Hi! Oh, hello, everyone! What? I have a little paddle boat if you want to try it, Peppa. Oh! Peppa is very <laughs> excited to try the paddle boat. Mm -hmm. Yes, please. <laughs> and Granny Pig can ride with me on my jet ski. Oh! But um, Granny Pig isn't sure she'll uh, enjoy Miss Rabbit's jet ski. Uh, Peppa uh, and Granny Pig have put on some life jackets oh. and helmets to keep safe. <laughs> now they are ready to ride on the water. Peppa's paddle boat has pedals to make it go. That's right, Peppa. Pedal forwards to make the boat move forward. <laughs> Does it go Off any slower? We go. <laughs> <laughs> Wait for me. <laughs> Have you found any colourful <laughs> shells, George? <laughs> oh, <laughs> this one's perfect. <laughs> Wonderful! George is finding lots of <laughs> shells on oh. the beach. <laughs> How about we use the shells to make a picture? Peppa oh. is having lots of fun <laughs> out on the water. <laughs> Granny! Granny's going in <laughs> But Granny Pig is looking rather seasick. Too George has made a dinosaur out of shells. Ooh, dinosaur! How clever! It just needs one more special shell for the eye. Oh. <laughs> Shiny! Well <laughs> done, George. Oh, Miss Rabbit's wave has washed George's shells back into the sea. Hello. Oh. Hello, Grandpa. Oh, dear. <laughs> but look, your special shiny shell is still here. Shiny! Wow, I like your sand dinosaur picture, George. George's <laughs> shells have left a dinosaur shape in the sand. Dinosaur! Peppa loves having fun at the beach. Everyone loves having fun at the beach. Welcome oh. to the ice cream shop. It is a very hot day. So Peppa and George are playing ice cream shop. Here you go, Mr. Daddy Pig. Oh, thank you. What would you like, Mrs. Mummy Pig? I'd like a banana split, please. Hooray! Oh. Ooh! What's a banana split, Granny? <laughs> it's a type of dessert. First, we need to cut a banana in half. Nana! Oh! Ho, 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 ho! Now, we add ice cream, cherries and whipped cream. Oh. George oh. likes adding the ice cream. Careful! Don't squish the oh. banana. <laughs> 
And Peppa really likes adding whipped cream. <laughs> Don't forget the cherry on top. Here is your banana split, Mrs Mummy Pig. <laughs> this looks delicious. Oh, please could I have a Knickerbocker Glory? Uh -huh. A Knocker Glory? What's that, madam? Ho, ho, ho. Uh -huh. It's a type of ice cream sundae. Can you only eat them on Sundays? Mm. Ho, ho. Not that type of sundae. You can eat them any time. Ah. I'll show you. Uh -huh. We need ice cream, fruit, meringue and cream. <laughs> Peppa and George add all the ingredients into the glass. And now you can decorate the top. Yay! Then decorate with wafers, colourful sprinkles and sauce. Here you are, ah, madam. This looks wonderful. <laughs> now everyone has been served, what kind of ice cream would you two like? Hmm, a rainbow <laughs> one. Rainbow. Peppa and George use lots of different <laughs> coloured ice cream. Pink for strawberry, brown for chocolate, yellow for <laughs> banana, nana. Then they add their toppings. Mm -hmm. <gasps> Let's mix it all together. Um. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Peppa and George have mixed all the colours together. We've made a muddy puddle. Ah. Not rainbow ice cream. I'm afraid we don't have much ice cream left. All we have is... Vanilla. My favourite. <laughs> Peppa and George like making special ice creams, but they love vanilla ice cream the most. Hello, everyone. Hello, Hello Peppa. Oh. <laughs> Mummy Pig is dropping Peppa off at Playgroup, but Mummy Pig is also looking after baby Alexander. Oh, my. Mind if I clean up Alexander's smelly nappy before I go, Madam Gazelle? I insist. <laughs> oh, can we help clean him up? Please! <laughs> OK. Can you pass me the nappy cream from the changing bag? <gasps> and a fresh nappy. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone likes helping Mummy Pig change baby Alexander's nappy. <laughs> there. Fresh as a daisy. Can baby Alexander play with us? Please! Well, I don't see why not. Hooray! Peppa is showing baby Alexander all her favourite bits of the playgroup. These are the books. <laughs> baby Alexander likes all the books. This is the whole world. <laughs> and he enjoys spinning the globe. <laughs> and this is Madame Gazelle. Bonjour, little Alexander. Oh! But he likes Madame Gazelle most of all. Uh -huh. <laughs> Perhaps it is time for some painting. <laughs> Everyone is painting pictures of themselves, Ooh. called ah. self-portraits. I'm Peppa Paint. Hello. <laughs> Hi, Peppa. I'm Freddy. <laughs> I'm Susie. <laughs> and I'm Gerald. <laughs> well done, baby Alexander. It looks like a tasty apple. Baby <gasps> Alexander's painting has reminded <laughs> Pepper that it's time for lunch. It's baby Alexander's mm. lunchtime too. He's eating special food for babies. Here comes the train, Alexander. Choo-choo! Is baby Alexander's food nice, Mummy? He thinks so. Oh. oh, my. Mind if I clean Alexander up again before we head off? I insist. I'll get the bag. Oh, let's go! <gasps> 
Oh, everyone loves having baby Alexander at playgroup. And baby Alexander loves visiting. <laughs> Today, Peppa and her family have been shopping at the supermarket. Goodbye, supermarket. Supermarket! <laughs> Is that a robot? <laughs> no, Peppa. It's a vending machine. You put money in to buy the food and drinks inside. Can we buy something from the robot, please? <laughs> OK. We can each choose one thing as a special treat. Yay! Peppa is very excited to buy something from the robot vending machine. Here you go, Peppa. <laughs> Goodbye, coin. Now, press the button that matches the thing you would like. I would like an orange juice. There it is. Hooray! Delicious. <laughs> Dinosaur. George has found a biscuit shaped like a dinosaur. Here you go, George. <laughs> now, press the button with the dinosaur. <laughs> dinosaur! <gasps> <laughs> I think I will have... Hmm, that drink. Oh dear, it's stuck. Daddy Pig's drink is stuck on a sandwich. The sandwich is in the way. Naughty sandwich. We'll need to buy the sandwich as well, so the drink will fall down with it. Oh. It's stuck again. Naughty pineapple. Ah, let's buy that too. It's stuck again. Again. <laughs> the drink has finally fallen all the way down to the bottom. Goody! I can finally have my drink. <gasps> oh no! My drink has turned into fizz. Poor Daddy. Why don't you choose something else from the vending machine? Good idea. <gasps> oh, the vending machine is empty. That's because we bought everything. <laughs> 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 Whoa! Today, Peppa and her playgroup are on a trip to a bug museum. Follow me, everyone. <laughs> oh. Squeak! Big box! This room is all about ants. It even has some big robotic ants to look at. Don't worry, it's not a real ant. It's a big robot. I love robots! Whoa! Ants work together as a team to bring food to their queen. Would you like to try being ants? Can I be the queen? Yes! Yay! Yay! <laughs> Yay! Peppa's friends are racing against the ants. They have to get the foam leaf to Queen Pepper. <laughs> Whee! Yes! Yay! Yay! Well done, everyone. You worked as a team just like ants. Ah. This room is all about bees. It even has bee <laughs> costumes for dressing up. You look the bee's knees. Can you find your way through the beehive like real bees? Bzz, bzz. Well, go. Bzz, bzz. Everyone loves being bees, but the beehive is very confusing. They're lost. 
bees follow the sun to find their way. Buzz! We can follow the sun too! <laughs> Everyone is following the sun to find their way, just like real bees. Beautiful work, everyone! <laughs> the last room has something very special inside. Squeak! It's so pretty! But nobody knows what it is. Inside is something very colourful. Is it a parrot? Quack! It has big wings. Or a dragon. Rawr! And it used to be a caterpillar. Hmm. Wow. It's a... <gasps> Butterfly! Peppa and her friends love learning about all the bugs at the Big Bug Museum.